In a major development, Hezbollah has officially confirmed the death of its leader, Hassan Nasrallah, following an Israeli airstrike in southern Beirut on Friday. The group described the strike as a treacherous Zionist airstrike in its statement on Saturday, declaring Nasrallah a sacred martyr and vowing to continue its fight against Israel. Nasrallah, who led Hezbollah since 1992, was killed alongside several senior commanders of the group, including Ali Karki, the commander of Hezbollah's southern front. Hezbollah's statement, broadcast on the Hezbollah-owned Almana TV channel, emphasized that the organization would remain committed to supporting Gaza and Palestine, as well as defending Lebanon. The leadership of Hezbollah pledges to continue its fight to confront the enemy, in support of Gaza and Palestine, and in defense of Lebanon and its steadfast and honorable people, the group stated. Nasrallah's death marks a pivotal moment in the long-standing conflict between Israel and Hezbollah. Israel confirmed it targeted Hezbollah's headquarters in Beirut's densely populated southern suburbs, where the militant group has a significant presence. Israeli Defense Forces, IDF, spokesperson Daniel Hagri, also confirmed that senior Hezbollah commanders were killed alongside Nasrallah. The death of Nasrallah comes amid escalating tensions following Hamas' October 7 attack on Israel, which prompted Hezbollah to launch hundreds of rockets across the Lebanon-Israel border. However, despite expectations of a larger retaliation from Hezbollah, the group's response has been limited compared to the major offensive Israel had anticipated. Israeli officials attribute the subdued response to the damage inflicted by Israeli airstrikes, which have targeted Hezbollah's command structure and operational infrastructure. Hezbollah's ability to retaliate remains a significant concern for Israel, particularly as the group assesses its next moves in the wake of losing its top leader. Israeli officials have acknowledged that while they have dealt a severe blow to Hezbollah's leadership, the group remains capable of regrouping and launching further attacks. Hezbollah's connection to Iran and its alliance with other militant groups, such as Hamas, Islamic Jihad, and factions in Iraq and Yemen, suggests that the broader conflict could escalate further. Hamas has also issued a statement mourning Nasrallah's death, praising his long-standing support for the Palestinian cause and condemning the Israeli airstrike as a heinous crime. Similarly, other militant groups and regional allies, including Islamic Jihad and Iraq's Muqtada al-Sadr, have expressed their condolences, with some calling for intensified resistance against Israel in response to Nasrallah's assassination. In the coming days, Hezbollah's commanders will likely be assessing their ability to regroup and determining their strategy moving forward. Meanwhile, Israel continues to carry out airstrikes on Hezbollah positions in Beirut, maintaining pressure on the group amid ongoing regional tensions. The death of Nasrallah has intensified fears of a broader conflict in the Middle East, with Israeli and U.S. officials closely monitoring the situation. U.S. officials have expressed concern that Iran, Hezbollah's key ally, may intervene in the conflict if it believes that Hezbollah is on the verge of collapse. The U.S. has been working on a potential ceasefire between Israel and Hezbollah, but that effort now appears uncertain following the latest developments. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu, who was in New York addressing the United Nations General Assembly when the airstrike occurred, has returned to Israel earlier than planned, reflecting the urgency of the situation. Israel's next steps, and Hezbollah's response, will likely define the trajectory of this conflict in the coming days and weeks. As the region braces for what could be a critical turning point, the possibility of a full-scale war looms larger than ever. Stay tuned to Playful Parade for ongoing updates and in-depth coverage as the situation continues to unfold. Become a part of the Playful Parade community. Smash that like button, drop a comment, share with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe. Road to 10,000 subscribers. Oh, 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 o